I have a word of encouragement to share with you. It comes from Isaiah chapter 65, verse 17. And so I invite you now to hear the word of God. For I'm about to create new heavens and a new earth. The former thing shall not be remembered or come to mind. The word of God for us, the people of God. Thanks be to God. So the prophet Isaiah tells us what this new heaven and this new earth will be all about. Uh, he tells us that there's going to be joy there, no more sorrow. Um, he says, I will rejoice in Jerusalem and delight in my people. No more shall the sound of weeping be heard in it or the cries of distress. The wolf and the lamb shall feed together. The lion shall eat straw like the ox. There's certainly a, a different way of living, a new way of, of life. And so in Jesus Christ, we are given uh, that new life. We are made into that new creation. And through the power of the Holy Spirit, we are then able to bring forth a new earth. We are empowered to tear down the walls that divide us. We're empowered to, to tear down those systems that oppress other people. We find ways to make sure that all are fed and closed. We can experience heaven. We can experience the kingdom of God right now in the here and now. And we do that by taking the love of God, that love of God that he has given to us, that he has placed in our hearts, and then finding ways to share that love with each, with each other. And so I want to encourage you this week to go out into the world wherever God has placed you and to find ways to be heaven, to be peace, to instill this new world with others. Amen. Well, let us pray. Holy God, we are so thankful uh, for Jesus Christ. We're thankful uh, for his works uh, here on earth, for his works on the cross, for for his love and Lord we just ask that as we respond to it to his love that we might uh, have the courage to share it with others it's in the name of Jesus Christ we pray amen and amen so this coming Sunday I want to invite you to come on out to experience the love of God uh, with each other we have a coffee fellowship around 9 40 Sunday school at 10 and worship at 11. You don't want to miss out, so come on out, invite a friend, and let us come together um, to worship God. With that said, grace and peace be to you from our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen.